Let's play Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. Welcome back and we will continue the adventures of Aiden Harris in the version 0 0.5 of the game. And last time I left off I was here in my safe house if you will in the northeast of this town where that blinking capital H is my note. Home storage sleep question mark. Last time I got myself a vehicle uh, uh, located uh, located uh, gas station I saw here in the map all along. I also got a road map so I do see all these towns around me but uh, now more urgently I will uh, I will try to sleep. Um, I'm not tired but I was hoping I could still sleep. Hmm. I'm thinking that do I need to actually drop these things? Drop these things here. Um, so that I don't sleep over encumbered. I don't know exactly how the how the game works. I am quite warm. I hope this will be okay. Alright, let's see. Oh, I woke up to the light. Hmm, interestingly, I do have closed curtains. But I guess that's okay. Was I wearing anything special? No. I had a blanket here. I think I will um I think I will take some of my uh, some of these things into the car. And I will start driving the car around and be more mobile than be here in this one location. I uh, drank some apple cider and I think I will have another zip as well. Unfortunately, it looks like my fruit have now rotten. The orange I was carrying, the oranges I was carrying are now gone. The meat pizza is gone. Mm. Yeah, I will. Uh, I will start start putting these things into my vehicle. I want to carry that filter mask instead of my gas mask. The gas mask is more of a More for the, for the fungaloids, if I ever, ever see some. Ah, right, I forgot to, forgot to set up the bubble wrap for this night. Um, most of the food... I will take with me. I don't, I don't think I will leave anything here in this house. I will take the longbow out. I have 40 arrows at the moment. Let's um, let's move this bookcase here and go see what we have out in the street. We have a wolf spider right there. Not too worried about that. We have a dog as well. Let me see if I need to do something about that wolf spider. We have crows, rabbits and squirrels here and... Uh, Right, this was my vehicle. No, it's not. My vehicle is south. The sun is just getting up. It is 6, uh, 6.22 at the moment. There's two wolf spiders. Hmm. 
their vision is not that great. Um, all right, let's uh, start this day by uh, with some hunting. I will uh, I will enable those skills because all those skills in the light red are something that will go down if I don't use them uh, with the skill rust. So I will be using those those today. Let's see, is that one in the range already? Yes, it is. All right, I forgot that. I need to get a pretty good shot with my longbow to hit it. Or actually do some damage on it. Hmm. And now it's coming on at me. Mm, let's take the Ruger. <laughs> Ruger and shoot this thing. Hmm, Alright, one shot. Uh, let's take that one and... Uh, mm, the other one is there far away. Let's butcher this. get some meat. I do need some food. Let's reload the gun. I think I will do some cooking here soon-ish. Let's drop the meat here. Drop that one there. I need to, need to get my bot before I do that. Right, let's try with the longbow again. Take those arrows, hide behind this motorcycle if needed. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Is the wolf coming at me? Yes, it is. Oh, wait, this wolf. Too close to comfort. I haven't had a, those wild animals attack me in a while. So here, here I am, starting the morning with... Uh, starting the morning by shooting around. The spider... is now coming for me. I will lure it into these traps and shoot it. Or not, because... Okay, it was not smart enough. Kaplow. Done for. The bear trap is okay, let's butcher it. Let's get the meat. I could get the bear trap as well. Well, maybe later. Let's cook some uh, tasty, tasty spider meat for breakfast. Let's drop the meat here for a while. Another wolf spider in the east. Well, that is, that is far enough, far enough away for me not to be troubled by that one. Did I leave the pot here? Yes, I did. Mm, let's get some clean water with me as well. Right, there's still the gallon, gallon jug full of water I prepared earlier. Let's get all this meat. And let's light this wood here. And let's cook. Cooking some meat, cooking some meat. Let's get a two by four. Like that. Some more meat, and 
was that's all of the meat. Yes, it was. And just in time when I'm hungry, let's have some tasty spider meat. Fresh and hot. Excellent. I will take some stuff into the trunk of the car and then I will see what I do. Now let's just make sure that this is my truck. It is, because it's named so. <laughs> Alright, so uh, let's drop items into this trunk here and now I can drop anything here. Let's go with the books. Gas mask, welding goggles. I will just put everything here. I will need to organize these later on, maybe. I'm not going to carry the tools right now. Let's put those, uh, those sewing kits in there. Lighters don't wear anything. Nails. Let's put the pot there. How much is that? It wasn't any of the weight. Mm. Let's put seven of the... No. Seven of the meats there. And then what else? I am still carrying the vehicle controls, the chunk of chitin. I don't want to read the book of first aid, but I will just put it in the trunk. of the thread here. It's also taking a little bit of space. The bubble wrap. I do have two flashlights as well. Let's take that's one and unload it. empty one there. Alright. And then let's go get more stuff from the from the house. Actually hmm. why don't I take this car and uh, drive it there. Cruise control is off, so let's carefully back here, turn this car around, even if I fumble with the controls a bit. Turn the car, turn the car, uh, just ignore the wolf spider, there we go. Carefully driving here. Okay, safe mode off. Is the spider coming for me? Hmm. You know what, Mr. Spider? I will run you down. Backing down, backing down. If I don't hit you, uh, 40 damage. Is it dead? I sure hope it is. 
Okay, so killed killed two with my rook or run over of one. Not a good day for a wolf. Not a good day for uh, wolf spiders. Okay, let's be careful here. I think I will turn the car around. Drive forward a bit. Break down. Turn it. Now, out the way around. I was reversing, I forgot that. And there we go, and then handbrake, which is S. We'll look that up. Yes, open that one. And then let's get some stuff to the trunk. Mm, everything from here. These ones as well. Those ones I don't need. Then uh, stuff from the fridge. Lemons are still good, but they're they're not very very good to drink. Those cans of coke or the tinned food will be my emergency food if I run out. There we go. Then let's finally take that milk. And uh, just take the bottle. Glass bottle of milk. Unload to the ground. Yes. And out the door. To the east is a wolf. Don't worry about that right now. Alright, so water will go here. Chuck will go here. Lemon beer. Root beer. There we go. Funnel. So Hmm, it is all all so um because now I have so so much stuff I can uh, I can have with me in these trunks. So it'll uh, take a little while to get this uh, organized. I will probably uh, and I will later on do a lot of this stuff. Um, a lot of this stuff um, out of screen. Bottles there as well. Right, I'm carrying a lot of weight because of the because of the ammo, the arrows, arrows and the magnum ammo. That, but my volume is relatively low, 36. Um, later on, when Aiden has trained a bit of bit of melee combat more more than now um, I can probably throw the probably throw the long bow long bow away do I have anything here no and what do I have here then Take those. I want to rip them apart at some point, and I think here was everything. I want all of these under the hood already, already. But of course, I guess I could keep it with me because I can. Uh, I don't know why. Now I'm over, over encumbered. Right, that's all from this house then. This was a good house to sleep in. I uh, I might might come back one day. Right. Hmm. 
strings. Why didn't I take the cardboard box? I don't know. Let's put it here in this car. <laughs> uh, just because I don't need it. Alright, so aluminum can. And that's a hood. The scarf. I don't think I will be repairing anything now, so uh, I'll keep those with me. Roll mats, close stick, digging stick can be here, scissors. Right, and I will take actually these uh, vehicle repair things here into uh, into this box. So let's drop here the welder, hacksaw, jack, and wrench. And with those, I should have the volume okay. Right, and I will actually drop also the ammo here from the magnum. So 199, leave them there. The casing is there. There we go. Let me look at these these medicines. Antipsychotic. Pretty sure I don't need the Thoracine. but the Xanax because it's anti-anxiety. I can actually get uh, get some morale boost from that one. Even even that I don't actually need anything for anti anti anxiety. Painkillers. So yeah, I think I can leave them. Leave the Thoracene into the trunk. Even even that it doesn't take any space. And now let's put some uh, some some stuff here. I don't need all of them on me, even that they don't take any space. Those that I have a lot of. Like uh, 450 aspirin. <laughs> um, all right, so now I think I'm ready. That was uh, quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of inventory management right there. Hmm. What I will do now is drive this car to the gas station and fuel it, and then I will see what I do. Right, that reminded me. Uh, what was the key? The kill count is 305. Unfortunately, I didn't check this before I drove through the drove through the town. But quite a lot of those are. Uh, I have killed quite a lot of zombies just with the bow, but uh, quite a lot of these numbers came from the car ride. Right, but uh, let's add to that number a bit if we see any on the way. So let me jump into the controls and uh, cruise control on and uh, let's go. A dog. Alright, let's try not to uh, get ourselves killed here. Wolf spider again. I might do a drive by shooting with my Red Hawk here, if nothing else. I'm, uh, I'm driving straight, but uh, because my driving isn't that great, it's already on level 1, but uh, it's not that high. I fumble with the controls and then I need to need to correct. So I will uh, I will drive to the next intersection down there and then uh, come forward. There's the bloody car I drove in the last trip that was just to uh, clear it away a bit and find the gas station and now I can take this uh, main vehicle there and uh, have less zombies to worry about. So this is the intersection. 
slowly turning. There shouldn't be too many zombies here, but if there are any, they will uh, most certainly, most certainly come at me when they uh, when they hear me. All right, let's uh, try to avoid crashing into those traps. Oh, fumbled with the controls on a critical moment. Oh, sorry, squirrel. Driving, driving, driving forward. So now I will drive all the way there. Looks like I have one zombie here on the way. Wishing to uh, get crashed. So there it goes, and then we have some children. Well, luckily they are zombies. So crashing, crashing into some more of them. There we go. So yeah, because of all the all the noise, they uh, they found me again. Mm. I think I will drive over some here now that I'm in the neighborhood. Yeah, that will. Uh, will damage my car a bit, but so now I can quite easily repair it. So let's go upwards a bit. Oh dog, stay out of the way. Stay out of the way. Don't crash into that bush, please. Of course I hit it. Alright, you know what? I will uh, I will drive away. Try to navigate between these car wrecks here. I want that gasoline before anything else. Steered into that sugar zombie there. Hit it with the side panel of my car. It's another one. Hmm. I might need to might need to turn around here. Oh a wolf spider. My old body. Take that. 85 damage. Yeah, this is all uh, all the same what we did last time. This time I can see those mines. I don't have the gas mask on. Alright, turning to car around. A zombie cop. Then careful trying to drive between these cars. So I'm driving about 30, mi 30 kilometers per hour. I don't actually know if the game... Hmm, is it just the number or does the game actually know that I'm driving 20 miles per hour? Or does it just calculate with the number that it's the uh, same if I drive 30 kilometers per hour or 30 miles per hour? Right. But uh, let's uh, slow down here. Carefully drive closer to this gas. Gas ones. Let's pull the handbrake, jump out before the zombie comes at me. No. Wait. Hmm. <laughs> No. No. Okay. What the hell is going on? Right, okay, now I know what I did. Um... Pull 
holds handbrake. Now, please exit. All right, good. I was uh, I was messing around with the controls. I will need to uh, shoot this zombie here. It had a nail gun. I will uh, I will pick it and put it in the trunk. There. Wolf, spider, and skeleton. Are you coming at me? No, you are not. Let's go here. Use the pump. Yes. Refill the vehicle. This one here until full. And now I have full tank of gas in this uh, main vehicle of mine. Did we take any damage? Uh, nothing new, I think. Yeah, those were all, all as they were. Now, a couple of the stores I more or less want to empty. And also check out are these hardware stores. Um, I want all the tools from there, and then also uh, I will see if they have um, if they have a presser in the backyard because with the presser I might be able to I might be able to. Um, Get myself some um, some steel to uh, plate this car with using that using that pressure. Or at least I think that's how it works. Well, that is something uh, something I will uh, I will figure out. First thing is I will go go there. All right, got one skeleton out of the way. There will probably be more more friends here. Then they come. A couple of dogs. Draw over them. Kill count keeps going up, and my car keeps getting hammered. So the first one is there, and there's also the other garage. Mm. Let's put the filter mask on, because that smoker zombie is there. There's also some car wreckage there I can't see. So right now I actually can't drive over the smoker. Oh no. Breaking down a bit. Let's clear this neighborhood as well. But, uh, the truck, even that I installed a muffler in this truck, makes so much noise that uh, all the all the zombies in the nearby town uh, do hear it and then come after me. That's why there has been so many of them as I've been driving around. Is that smoker zombie still in the wreckage? So I can't see a thing there. All right, let's uh, let's go forward. The hardware store is right there. Oh, help! Please don't crash my game. Thank you. Uh, looks like Sebastian Adams is right here, very close by. Sorry about that. Sorry about that spider. Handbrake. Exit the vehicle. 
jump out, wield the longbow, let's save some ammo. And shoot the zombie. Oh, wait a minute, I, I do want to. Yeah, I don't think I want to level up my archer. The firearms, I will lock that as well. Still hitting you, was I? No, I did. Good. Mm, I better put the save mode on as well. Twenty two rats rat shot. Well, that is that is ammo. Let's take that. So there are zombies, zombies to the north, okay, so there, what is that? This human corpse. Mm. There's either NPC who died or some, uh, some group like scientists or military group that died there. Shooting this zombie with a longbow here before checking the hardware store. Some of the zombies, they follow the scent. Scent I left uh, and the noise, noise I left with the car. Uh, like that smoker zombie there. Okay, let's see what we have back here. This hardware store doesn't have anything. Mm hmm. Oh, good shot, thank you. Okay, that sm smoker needs to be taken care of, and it will be a bit of a trouble. I do need a Ruger for that, I need, and I need a good shot. The filter mask is on, good. Mm. Alright. Why don't you come here, then? Waiting until it's close to me, so I can shoot. And also that I know where I am. Could I even lure it into the tire? No, I didn't. Hell time to shoot it. Unfortunately, it passes right through it. The zombie might get a hit on me. Especially here. Wait a minute. Let's continue running through the smoke to the north and then to the northwest from here. Yes, got it into the tire. That will slow it down. Shooting it. Unfortunately, it misses. Waiting. Taking another shot. Again, it misses. It hits me. And I'm out of ammo. Oh, shit. Oh, hell. Run. Uh, hmm. <laughs> okay, knife. I'm in a little bit of a trouble here. Mm. Eat. Mm. Coffein pills. We need speed. So I have the need for speed. Oh, please just stop asking me about the smoke. I'm already in the smoke. Smoker zombie is very fast too. There, I got it into one of the tires, hitting with the combat knife. Good, one hit. Two hits. It hits me as well. Let's do the same thing. Back away to the other tire. Waiting here. Hitting it again. Mm -hmm. It's severely injured. Fourth hit, I missed. Running again. Now oh, these bastards are... Uh... Mm -hmm. How will I lose you? 
I don't need that many hits anymore, but I need to get them need to get this one into the tire. To slow it down. There it goes. Boom. Ah <sighs> wow. Alright. Let's take some aspirin. For the little pain it's caused me. The smoker zombie, not a joke, not a joke. I think I will change my boots into sneakers. So uh, let me uh, let me run a bit better. All right, let's take the longbow out and uh, let's uh, deal with these other zombies here. There's one coming from the south as well, waiting here. I think that uh, that explosion when the zom smoker zombie exploded when I stabbed it, that uh, brought some more, brought some more here as well. All right, let's have a drink. Drinking the orange juice because that will go bad soonish. Can I please get into this uh, this hardware store now and do what I came here to do? There's a coyote in here. Interesting. All right, there are rubber hoses here. Those are relatively relatively rare and a metal tank. That metal tanks means additional gasoline tank or water tank to my vehicle. Excellent. All very, very nice. All right, let's, uh, let's start from there. Okay, Coyote, do I need to shoot you or will you, uh, will you cooperate? Rubber hose is very nice because I can create, uh, I will take the funnel as well. I think I already had one, but uh, more to, more to better. Lawnmower. I think I can take that apart. The metal tank weights quite a bit. So I will haul my ass back into the truck with this stuff. The coyote doesn't seem to bother me. Uh, okay, let's make this trunk at hardware storage. Mm, let's put the lawn mover in as is. Duct tape nails as well. The ammo will go elsewhere. The funnel can go here. Alright, what's that's it? Right, and now. Uh, once I remember, let me uh, reload the reload the Ruger. Mm. I picked up a spray can. Looks like I did. I want the crowbar. Oh, there's an extra extra flashlight. Well, let's leave it here as well. The pipe. V10. Then we drop the rat shot in there. All right, and then we get some more stuff from here if there is any. Well, I will take some wood. Broom, also wood. Mop might be useful. Vacuum sealer. I uh, well, I don't need another nail gun. I already have one. Are you going to? Uh... Oh shit! You are. Oh coyote! Take that! <laughs> Headshot! Oh man! You just couldn't leave me be, could you? And some duct tape. Okay, 
this uh, hardware store is now looted. Here, broom, two by four, copper wire, the mop, vacuum sealer, and I think that was it. Yeah, let's go check the other hardware store, and it was south of here, and there's also military surplus there. There's a park and there's a house and there's a restaurant. There's a furniture store and there's a clothing store. There's a police station. I will stay away from the police station, but uh, I will check the other ones. All right, this other garage. The NPC that was in the neighborhood went away. Let's turn the car around here. Uh, just wait, wait, wait. Brake, wait, handbrake, exit, open, get up, get out. And let's winch this out. And what do we have here? Uh, electric motor. There's a motorbike wheels, bicycle wheels, there's an engine. Do I want to take that engine with me? Hmm. I think I want to take the electric motor. That would be awesome if uh, at some point I drain my electronics all the way up and then um, all the way up and I can install it and then install solar panels and I can just drive with the power of the sun. So let's put the electric motor here. As far as I know, the space of the trunks is only limited by the number of items, not by the weight. Let's jump a dog and a dog there. Let's take the normal motor as well. I think that uh, that will uh, fit my car as well. I might have several. Let's take additional welder. Okay, so I'm uh, here uh, hauling, hauling a full size engine around. Let's drop them here, the welder and the engine. Now I should be okay again, yeah. All right, so that that actually would be a bigger bigger engine for my car if I uh, if I take it. All right, so there was nothing other useful stuff in that garage. There was some in the other other one that uh, I will probably go back to to repair my vehicle a bit later on. But then that hardware store. Let's back away here a bit. And then let's drive down south. Okay, let's drive over some zombies then, because they want to. Where did you all come from? Everyone wants to join the party. So let's drive south on this street. Let's drive right there between these two. Please don't fumble much. I do fumble a bit, but uh, my driving is already on 66% uh, towards the second level, so it's doing okay. 
So here only one zombie remains. This, <laughs> oh man, this, uh, this square here. <laughs> oh man. Oh, sorry, squirrels and spiders and everything. Uh, it's uh, you shouldn't really be on that. Uh, that's bloody, <laughs> bloody place. Um, here's the other hardware store. So let's let's uh, slow down here. Pull the handbrake. Exit. Open it. Let's wait one more time, just in case. And they are coming after me. Let's take the longbow. Is there anything in the east? There's a wolf spider that might have heard me come in with the car, but we'll see. Let's hide here. There's the traps I can use as well in case uh, I get a really big, big pile of these guys. All right, got that zombie down. Of course, there's a whole lot of corpses for me to check if I want to. Now, first, I want to check this one. Uh, there's a wood axe and wood saw here. I already had found some. Where did I leave them? Was it here? Yeah, in this liquor store I le left them wood axe and saw, but I will of course get them here now that I can. There's even some food in here. There's a steel cherry can. There's a plastic cherry can. Excellent, 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 excellent. All, all these will uh, will go into my car, and there's even more. Uh, well, the the cherry cans will most most certainly help. I think the steel cherry can is the biggest one. Uh, it can contain two hundred units or something, so I can get some backup fuel to my truck, and I think I will use the other cherry can just to store water. Uh, to, the, to the car. And there's also a metal tank, something I can install to the car. But uh, this uh, video has gone long, long enough already, so uh, there's even a steel frame here. I will, uh, <laughs> I will empty this whole store here and uh, put more or less everything into my truck and uh, then uh, I will probably pick up from there in the next video, and uh, in the next video I will uh, I will drive. Uh, well, actually I will check. The... Let's do it here. Is there a is there an entrance to the back of this? Uh... Yes, there is. Oh, look at that! That's exactly what I was looking for. Steel compactor. That is functional. Yes. Ha ha! Recycle metal into lumps, sheets, chunks, or scraps. So uh, what I need is a shovel, and uh, then I can start smacking these lockers into uh, into pieces of metal, or find one of those uh, steel wreckage sites with a lot of metal wreckage, and then I can bring all those into that uh, into that compressor and start making sheets of steel for my car and put uh, put a plating, put some spikes on it and uh, all kinds of good stuff. Really make it a make it a truck of doom if it's not that already. But as said, I will uh, I will empty this door. There's so much stuff, then uh, it'll just be me hauling stuff. So that's something something good I can do off screen and uh, then come back in the in the next video. Um, with that stuff in the truck, and we will uh, see if I can um, if I can already repair my vehicle, or will I just haul the stuff to the garage and do something then? But anyway, I hope to see you on the next video when this uh, journey with Aiden Harris continues. Until then, take care. Bye bye.